Hey, what's up, guys? I got Georgia out here. Um, I just wanted to do like a pre-lesson uh, video, just kind of prepping you for what to expect, what we're going to be going over and the stuff like that. So um, first things first, when you first get here, we're just going to let her out. We're going to let you guys meet. Now, remember, she she has a reference sheet for each of us. So she's been behaving a certain way for us. You know, I no jumping, no being super crazy all the time under obedience but for you she's gonna flip back in her little reference book and be like ah mom how do i act around mom um okay come on good girl and she and, she, and then she's gonna almost revert back to to how she used to be that's totally okay and that's totally accept acceptable we almost expect that to happen after she's gone rogue a little bit you guys have said your hellos we're gonna collect her up and start with our first thing which is a recall okay uh you're going to be one of her biggest distractions so it's going to be great to use you to train um she's on a, a pile of poop so i'm going to go ahead and call her georgia come good girl go place good place um once we do a good recall and she's like into it and she's and we've gotten her engagement back with us then we're going to go ahead and go to the place bed once she's totally with us then we're going to hand her over to you at that point, you're going to probably start off with just walking around the room, getting back used to each other, joining up is what we call it. Once you guys join up, we're probably going to have you go over either to the place bed or start with the recall. And the same rules apply everywhere. You say her name, you say the command, uh-uh, place. Whether it's come or down, sit, go place, whatever it may be, you say her name, then you say the command. And then you wait. Did she do it? Yes or no. If she did it, good girl you give her food pets whatever you have to give her if she doesn't do it then you have to make her do it so tomorrow we're going to have you set up with a leash uh, and everything like that we're going to be having you communicate with her through the leash but we will be uh, backing you up with the e-cover as well so um expect that uh it'll be really good once you have her manually under control then we're gonna transfer you over in your next lesson to the e-collar um I think that's all I have for you guys. That's my little spiel, uh, what to look forward to. Um, once you guys are successful with everything off leash, then we basically are uh, are good to go for, for that lesson. Um, but it'll be roughly about an hour um, and we'll walk you guys through all your paces and make sure you're all comfortable. We'll go ahead and answer any questions that you have, um, any questions that you may have you know, from this video, please feel free to ask or write them down, bring them with you tomorrow, um, either way. It'll be it'll be a really good lesson. So um, I hope all this stuff makes sense. Uh, I hope I've prepared you uh, officially for your lesson tomorrow. Um, I'm gonna go. She she's so funny. Look at her. Wow, wow, buddy. That's cute. Good girl. Okay. Good girl. Good girl. Here you go. Um. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna close the video out here. See you later. Bye.